Which way is through the grove? It just says path south. Alright then. Grove, look at that. Attack that first. Uh, push that and keep attacking that. Time to rumble. Yep, time to rumble. Thanks for that, Karth. Take out the baby first. Do a bunch of power attacks. Hit him. Time to Take rumble. Out. Who's down? Karth fell. Oh. All right. That won't last long. I need more med packs. Do I have anything that's going to help me here? The energy shields will be useless. Fine headband. Improved power blast, okay. Strength gauntlets, okay, I'll keep that then. Uh, improved power blast, that's a good one, let's get that. Okay. Maybe I should just take that off for now. Better chance to hit. Stunray, flamethrower. Stunray is going to be better, I think. Okay. What? You use a med pack. You Ready. use lots of med packs. Oh wow, this is a really poor use of med packs, I think. Sure. Oh well. Let's go this way. I can head back afterwards. Sandro grounds. Come on. Get moving. Sandro droid. Well, this guy's not armed to the teeth like the other one. This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? My orders are clear. Please leave immediately. Only those on official family yeah, yeah, I heard the speech from the other guy. Okay, so this side is useless. You can't get past that stuff. Where am I supposed to go? I don't remember. Is it off this way side maybe? I don't know. Did I just say off this way side maybe? That doesn't make much sense. There's a bridge over here, right? Yeah. Ooh, sorry, Cathound. Time for you to die. Oh no. Didn't think this through very well. Why did you run up here, Karth? You have a death wish? Down you go! I am going to lose this. I'm going to die to a bunch of cat hounds. Okay, well, it might take out Kath while I'm doing it, but frag grenade! They're not Kath, Karth. Oh! 
Go away! Run away! Run away! Do a stun ray. Stun ray. There, there you go. Okay. That was bad. That was really bad. I'm in the grove, though, so not too far off. At least. Push him out. Push him out. And get this guy. I think I'm gonna have to head back to the ship and get some red tags. I did not prepare for this at all. Back and force push. Why aren't you using your stun gate ray? Oh, you don't have a stun ray. Well, use your other thing there. Flamethrower. Yep. You asked for this! Okay. Return to Evan Hawk. Service return to Evan Hawk. No, I'm not sure at all of that, actually. Baluk. Arrival here is well timed. Who are you? I am Baluk, Jedi from the Enclave. Except for the Jedi Council to investigate a killing that took place here a few hours ago. The location does not pose problems. Those species speak basic and hutties. I'm going to handle this myself. Nothing here. Oh, great. We have to help with the truth, do I? Listen to the stories. So I can access the archives. Okay. Okay. Okay then. Many of the accounts of the participants, these three men, were out here in the field together earlier before the clouds broke. I find that very odd. Most people would seek shelter indoors in the skies filled with dark storm clouds, as it was earlier today. But that is not the most puzzling aspect of the case. The dead man, Elder Nedek, was shot in the back with a blaster rifle. The rifle was found lying near his body with bloodstains on it. He sent back to the Enclave for analysis. Two other men were found at the scene when I arrived. One was handing gold. He was unarmed. The other was Rickard Lissop, who was carrying a hunting laser. Both men say they did not do anything and they came across the body. Both also accuse the other. Obviously, there's more than what we have been told. Anything else I should know? And in this woman's side, Ricker was saving one of his legs. Do you remember this when we progress through the case? So they're both injured. Hmm. Remain here while you question the witnesses. Okay. Let's question the witnesses. Another Jedi, huh? Helping that Twi'lek investigate, no doubt. He seems stumped. I'm Rickard Lusoff. Maybe you can figure this out and let we'll me see. get out of here. Tell me what happened. Well, I was out hunting Eriaz when I spotted one over here by the bridge. I pull out my rifle and aim at it. I couldn't see it that well, mind you, because the damn sun was in my eyes. So I shoot it and it drops. I walk over here and find Handed standing okay, over how is the sun body. Eyes so why don't you get this whole farce over everything. with and send that whiner Handed to the prison he belongs in? Ah, greetings. You must be assisting Master Baluk in his investigation. I'm Handed Gould. Perhaps you've heard of me? Well, I presume you wish to hear my story then. I shall tell you, of course, but there's not much to it. 
I'm sure that you'll agree that Rickard is quite obviously guilty of murder. You see, I was out here running earlier today. Yes, running. I do that a lot. Can't stand speeders, never use them. Keeps me in shape, too, you know. Anyway, I was out running on the other side of that bridge there, and all of a sudden I heard a shot coming from over here. I ran over and found this man Calder lying on the ground, dead. Go on. Then I saw Rickard come skulking out of the shadows of the rocks south of the river, and I knew something was wrong. I hit my emergency button and called the enclave right away. Well, there. That's my story. Now, please hurry this up and arrest Rickard so I can get on with my day. Hey, information droid. Greetings, apprentice. You must be the one Master Baluk has enlisted yes, to help I am. with this problem. I am an information retrieval droid. I can assist you by accessing the records of both the Jedi Enclave and the central government facilities here in Dantooine. If you have any need of my services, please do not hesitate okay, to stop talk talking. To I have already retrieved okay. some information. Is there any information yes, you I do. require? What did you find about the body? My preliminary analysis of the body indicates that he was killed approximately three hours ago by a single energy blast to the torso. Is there any other information you need? Mm. Tell me about these planes. These planes are rife with wild animals, not all of them benign. The Iriars are mostly docile, but can easily be provoked to violence. Calf hounds, on the other hand, are much more deadly. There have been over 35 catalogued attacks on settlers by calf hounds in the last two weeks. A general advisory was given out three days ago to carry a weapon at all times when on the plains. Small farms and holdings dot the plains and can provide safe refuge for those in need. Is there any other information you need? Sorry about that, guys. When the phone rings, gotta answer it. Fortunately for them, I did not want to take a quick two-question survey today. Uh, I will have more questions later. Very well. I will... Can I investigate the body? We eat a non diet. What are you, ma? Okay, check the body. Apparently, shot from behind with a blaster. Yeah, I already knew that. How can I be a further. Hmm. What did you see happen? I will. Actually, I, I didn't see anything. I was over across the bridge. I heard a shot and came over. I can tell you I was sure surprised to see Calder's body lying there. I just got here when I saw Rickard coming out of the rocks holding his blaster. I was terrified. I had no idea what he was going to do, so I hit my emergency button and called the Enclave. Master Baloo came out here with his droid and started questioning us. I, I think he really doesn't understand Probably understands what's going more on. Than I hope that you'll be able to make a more informed decision and get me out of here soon. I have things I have to do. I want to ask you something else. How can I be of further assistance? Why were you out here? I was taking my daily constitutional. I just happened to be running by when I heard a shot. I ran over and found Calder's yeah, body lying there. You're pretty consistent with this so far. Yes, quite often. I generally prefer running to anything else. Can't stand speeders. A healthy body will breed a healthy mind, as I always say. <laughs> Hold your side. Are you injured? In injured? No, of course not. Why would I have been? Fit as a bath, though. <laughs> I run. I don't know if I mentioned that. I want to ask you something else. How can I... You're holding your side. Are you injured? In injured? Okay, well, that's all for now. Of then. course. And you, at least. So, what do you this want to know? This guy's rough, but that doesn't mean anything else. Well, I was out hunting Eria south of here, and I saw one over by the bridge. The sun was pretty much right behind it, though, so I couldn't see it none too clearly. I shot, and when I came over here, I found Handon standing over the body, holding his side. There wasn't an eerie as in sight, but I think he might have taken it. Calder must have been hunting it himself, because there was a rifle lying close to the body. Bullock's got that now. Mine, too. I want that back. Ask so, me something what do you else. want to know? Uh, why were you out here? I told yeah. you already, didn't I? Was hunting some areas. Haven't seen many in the area recently, what with those calf hounds acting up. But they're still around. Was in my blind a little south of here when I spotted one, like I said before. I shot and pow, went down. But when I come over here, there's Handon standing over the body and the areas was gone. Now I don't have nothing to do with this, so can I go now? Um, so, are you hurt? Well, 
kind of sprained my ankle running through the bush before I found the body, but it's nothing that okay. serious. So, right. Okay, information droid. Do you have anything? Is there any other information? Nothing. Okay, I'll have more questions okay. later. Let's talk to this guy. Oh, a coupon. Okay. Yeah, before the clouds broke, this is wrong. Want to discuss the murder? Instead, he was shot right over. Only if I called her already dead. That Rickard came out of the shadow of the rocks, holding a blaster in his hands. It said that he was hunting Iriaz. Saw one through the glare of the sun and shot at it. It's possible that Rickard may have shot Calder accidentally, and Handy may have found the body. It seems a very unlikely explanation. More likely that at least one of them is lying. Obviously, one of these men is not telling us something. Where is the truth lie? Rickard is lying. It was cloudy. There was no sun glare. Yeah, that happened as Rick Rickard said the sun would not have been visible at the time of the killing, so you have caught Rickard in a bit of a lie. Okay. Say to the next point. We need to find a motive for the killing. Maybe you could talk to the men about the relationship with the victim. Anything else you need to remain here while you question the witnesses. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Is there any Tell me about Calder and Handon. The Southwood Speeder rental business has records that over the past several weeks, a speeder had been rented by Mr. Netic and Mr. Gold. Mr. Gold Is there any speeders. other information you need? According to the municipal authorities near the Garrow spaceport, there had been news of violent drunken activity in a cantina attached to the port. Apparently, a Mr. R. Lusoff was making accusations at a Mr. C. Netic about cheating him in a business deal. Jedi Tuka was dispatched to the scene okay, and restored order. You know. Is there any other information you need? My preliminary analysis. Is there any other? Okay. Very well. So. He's lying a little bit, but let's talk to Rickard first. So, what do you want? Um, hmm. Did you know the victim? Yeah, I knew him. Hell, we've known each other for a good long time. Doesn't mean I really have to have liked the slime ball. <sighs> Maybe I shouldn't be so hard on him. Especially now that he's dead. We actually got along pretty well most of the time. We just had our what differences, differences with those. We were be? actually business partners. We were involved in some orbit to ground transport operations for Aerotech. Can I leave now? I should probably be the one to give the news to his wife. But Calder was cheating you. Now I don't love Calder, but we go back a long way. We run a suborbital shipping and transport company out of Garang Spaceport. We've been partners in that business for well over twenty years, and we've been doing just fine the way we are. Okay. Hmm. There was bad blood between you. Right. Hand in gold. How can I be of further assistance? Oh, um, we went to the speeder with him. But I, I realize this must seem like a motive to you, but I assure you it isn't. I dislike Calder, true. I would punch his face in, given the opportunity, but I would not kill him. Punch his face in, why? My wife was cheating on me with him. I slept in my own bed while I was in the next room. But, as much as I may hate him for that, yes, I could not kill him. It may have been my own fault for driving my wife away. I must try not to take the I law into did, my though. own hands. I was just out running, trying to clear my head for the divorce proceedings, not stalking him to kill him. Running is not a crime. I ask you something How else. Can I... Why would someone want to kill him? Um, well, you see, Calder was involved in some pretty sordid business from time to time. More often than not, I've heard. Disreputable business practices, even more disreputable clients. I've even heard he had dealings with a hut. A hut here on Dantooine. Now, I bet you're wondering if I had any reasons to kill the man, but I tell you, I hardly knew him. 
I saw him once or twice, yes, and I've heard some pretty unkind things about him, but certainly nothing that would make okay. me want to kill him. No one says you killed him yet. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm getting a bit agitated. Why must we remain here? Can't you see that Rickard must have shot him? Of course, of course. It's all for now. Is there any other? Uh, I have more questions later. Thanks. So, what do you want? Why would someone want to kill him? You Jedi are so predictable. Always seeing some greater purpose behind everything. When the simple answer is yeah, usually I, the I right. I agree. One. Can't you see that it must have been Handon? I found him standing over the damned body. I don't know why this is causing you so much trouble. You almost seem as lost as this. It's all right. for now. Okay, let's talk to Baluk here. Oh. Oh. Um, I want to discuss the murder. Examine the relationship each man had with the victim. If only he barely knew the victim. On the other hand, the record and the victim were business partners. According to Rickard, they got along quite well on the surface. The other man seems to have a motive for killing Calder. And in his line, why do you believe that? He knew his wife was cheating on him. Perhaps we don't no focus on the murder weapon itself. We might want to see the information the witnesses are going to provide. The last we found near the body. Is there anything else you need? I'll remain here while you question the witnesses. Alright, Rickard. So, what do you want to know? What about the weapon found by the body? That blaster? Never seen it before. Calder himself had a preference for Ichani weaponry. He had this one really nice light blaster rifle that he always used. Always wished I could get myself a rifle like the one he had. That blaster ain't it, though. Calder only had the one rifle, too. So he either must have borrowed that, or it's someone else's. Right. So he knew something about the weapon. How can I be of further assistance? Uh, what do you know about the weapon found by the body? That blaster was stolen from my house last week. I never knew what happened to it. I hardly have enough money to afford a single blaster, let alone another. I can't tell you how important it is to have a weapon on hand with all these ravenous cath hounds around. Even an eerie can take a man down if it gets in the mood. Every settler has a weapon. It's our most prized possession. I would most appreciate it if I could have that back after you determine that Rickard is the killer. How can I be of further assistance? Hmm. In injured? Of course. All right, well, let's talk to the droid and see if he has any information about the weapon. Is there any other information? The report of Handed's blaster being stolen. With the weapon found at the scene. I am sorry, but I seem to be failing you. I have searched I can't and find searched, anything at all about a blaster being stolen. I thought to find the record of the missing. Is there any other? What about the weapon found at the scene? We cannot get any more specific analysis from that sample, other than the fact it did not belong to Calder. Is there any other information you need? Anyway, I should probably talk to Hand in here. How can I be a further... Oh. Of course. Oh. Oh. Wish to discuss the murder. Oh. Blaster's Handins. He lied about it being stolen. He says when he reported his soul, the blaster didn't belong to the victim. Okay, one part of this is the puzzle. It's a blood sample on the weapon that is sent back to the analysis before you arrive. Perhaps you can inquire with the information droid about it. Yep, I will talk to the information droid. Is there any other blood sample? I have just received back an analysis of a sample of the blood found on the weapon. It had been sent back to the enclave hey, just before me. you arrived. The blood on the weapon is definitely not Calder's. Unfortunately, there was a bacterial contaminant in the sample that had been taken back to the laboratory, and it had become degraded. Okay. We cannot get any more specific analysis from that sample, other than the fact it did not belong to Calder. Is there any other information you need? It did not belong to Calder, huh? Very well. How can I be of further assistance? Being injured? In of course. So, what do you... Nothing right now. Right. Okay, let's talk to Baluk then. Uh, uh, cool. Discuss the murder. It didn't belong to the victim. Discuss which one. Handon's blood. 
He's clutching his side. Hey, 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 what are you doing? Blood and it appears to have suffered some sort of blaster wound to his side. So there's only one logical scenario. Handon killed Calder for having an affair with his wife. Rickard was out hunting and accidentally shot Handon after he had killed Calder. I agree, and so you have made the judgment in this case. I can leave now, then. You can go now. What? No! Okay. No! If I'm going, I'm not going alone. You don't know what you've done! What do you mean? Look, I came out here, I admit, to kill Calder. But so did Rickard. He must have thought it was Calder when he shot and hit me. So I'm going to prison, but I shouldn't be going alone. Did you idiots have to let the slime ball go? Oh. I thought I did. Yes, you tentacle-headed... I came out here and killed Calder, but Rickard was here to do that too, and he shot me by mistake. Oh, great. Today may the force be with you. That was kind of weird fading. 470 experience points. That's pretty good.